Welcome to Worldwide Business. I'm Kathy Ireland. Our homeland safety and global security is a top priority. Critical to our defense is the implementation of faster wireless communication systems. TRM Microwave is a leading supplier of defense-related radio frequency and microwave components for commercial, space, and military applications. Owner and CEO, Wendy Tirolo, is here to discuss their custom engineering and manufacturing solutions. Welcome, Wendy. Thank you, Kathy. It's an honor to be here. Wendy, could you please tell us what you found to be some of the biggest challenges in the RF microwave industry? Certainly, I think one of the number one challenges that we face today is just finding qualified people to get into the industry, mm -hmm. um, most specifically engineers. Um, we need mechanical and electrical engineers in this industry, in the RF microwave world, and they seem to be gravitating more towards other industries like gaming design, but we really do need qualified, bright, intelligent people to work in this industry to help with our defense. And will you please discuss how TRM Microwave is addressing these challenges? Yes, so we are working with all of our local colleges, both in-state and out-of-state. Um, Raytheon, who is our mentor, is also helping us recruit young people. We do college internships. We use agencies. We try to use everything that we can at our disposal. And we've had very good luck. We've been very blessed. Um, uh, to have these wonderful opportunities to work with these colleges. And so far, so good. We've done really well. Oh, that's wonderful. Well, let's discover more about TRM Microwave in this Worldwide Business Field Report. With the ever-escalating stakes of technology, coupled with an unpredictable world, the once small and specialized industry of RF and microwave development is even more essential. TRM Microwave provides expert knowledge, first-class engineering leadership, and endless creativity to the development of new products for the telecommunications, aerospace, industrial, and military markets. Bottom line, TRM is on the front line of creating cutting-edge solutions and new innovations for big problems and big ideas. We're communicating to our customers that we are there for the entire cycle, from discovery to concept to prototypes, transition into production, production, and then the end of life. So what we're letting our customer know is that we're there the entire time. Our marketplace, an entire time, can be 12 months. It can be 20 plus years on uh, some of the programs that that life cycle goes over. And we also describe in that life cycle all the value-added propositions that TRM provides our customers in every one of the phases. That helps us align our right resources to the program at the right time to be as much value in serving our customers as we can be. TRM Microwave owns a fully equipped ISO 9001-2008 and AS9100 facility and expansion site where they design, manufacture, and test their own products. TRM has more facility space available to us now as we're leasing out the building next door. Um, the good news is our challenge was we're growing at a rate that our current business couldn't support us uh, and couldn't support the activity to meet our customers' demands. So the new space gives us opportunities to really approach it without the history being in the way. And what I mean by that is it's a clean sheet of paper. And so modern manufacturing will go into that. You will start to see over the coming months new manufacturing areas that are set up with robotic operations, with lots of data available to it, uh, with processes being well controlled. Uh, so to meet the requirements of what our customers want in the future, it's about reducing variation and a modern version of manufacturing will be built into the new work center. With a high commitment to quality, TRM Microwave invests heavily in new capabilities in order to outpace the competition and control as much of the process as possible. TRM Microwave has been a solid production partner with us for over 15 years. That relationship, having a consistent long-term relationship is, is very, very important. And the management of TRM Microwave has been dedicated to our projects and BAE systems for that entire time. So that it's the durability of the relationship that's important to BAE. TRM Microwave has improved BAE systems defense programs by not only providing a technically compliant product, but providing it at a reliable rate of production so that we can consistently deliver to our suppliers. Being consistent in your delivery is the most important thing you can do as a contractor. TRM's commitment to their customers is bolstered by a tireless team of independent field sales reps who ensure customers get A-plus treatment. 
For over 46 years, TRM Microwave has provided engineering leadership and unparalleled creativity in bringing customer ideas to life. Wendy, can you please highlight what TRM Microwave specializes in? Yes, threat signal detection, uh, satellite communication, radar. We produce RF microwave components for the military, uh, which are about 85% custom and 15% uh, commercial. And we have the unique ability to blend three technologies. We do strip line, coax, and ferrite. Uh, most companies in our space only do one or a couple, mm -hmm. and it allows us to be able to come up with creative solutions for our customers. Uh, we do business with all the prime defense contractors. They come to us with a need, and we have our engineers work with them from cradle to grave. So we, they come with their specs and what they need, and we work with them from beginning to end. Uh, all of our parts are in all military aircraft, uh, from the Joint Strike Fighter all the way back to the F-22 and F-15. And Wendy, can you talk about some of the markets you serve and what you're doing for them? Yes. Uh, so some of our biggest customers are Boeing, Raytheon, um, Harris, L3. Uh, we actually just became a part of the Mentor Protege program with Raytheon, which was very exciting. We went through oh, a three year. Congratulations. Thank you. We had a three year vetting long process that we had to be approved. And uh, they're there to mentor us and help us grow. And they poised us for a 40% growth in business this year. And what sets you apart from other companies in the RF and microwave field? I have a brilliant staff of engineers, both mechanical and engineering, as well as assemblers. We have our own machine shop. We're getting into uh, pick and place machines, more robotics. My engineers are creating our own machines so that we can customize more parts for our customers. And I think that we're nimble and flexible and we have low overhead. Um, it allows us to compete against companies, you know, 10 times our size, and yet we can still beat them in product and price. And Wendy, can you please share some of TRM Microwave's latest achievements? So we just celebrated 46 years in business last year. Today, this year will be 47. And uh, we just became AS9100 certified. And uh, of course, like I just mentioned, the Mentor Protege program was a huge feather in our cap. Wendy, please tell us about some of the challenges in getting the next generation of professionals interested in the RF microwave industry. Um, we found that focusing on the employees and the younger generation, letting them work whatever hours they want to work as long as we focus on re end results and getting the job done, mm -hmm. um, they're much more uh, prepared to come to work and stay focused and disciplined um, if you give them a little leeway. Uh, but we have blended uh, younger talent with uh, some of our more senior staff and it's wonderful because the younger generation is learning from our senior executive staff. And what do you want young people to know about the industry? Um, that our country desperately needs this, this technology um, to keep our country safe um, and uh, to know that it is a financially rewarding career. Um, it's, it's, if you're passionate about this country and serving the defense industry, it's definitely the career for you. And Wendy, can you please tell us a little bit about your story and what led you to start with the TRM Microwave? So I started 23 years ago, and I actually have a similar story to Carly Fiorina, where I started out as the receptionist and uh, worked there for a couple of years getting the ISO um, uh, program in place and uh, worked my way up through the company. Um, ended up marrying the founder of the company two years after I started there. And he was really my, my greatest mentor. He taught me everything from the ground up and then um, asked me if I wanted to take over the business someday. So seven years ago, he appointed me CEO, asked me if I wanted to do it, and I said I actually have to think about it because this is a huge responsibility. Um, but loving our business and the, the industry that we serve, um, it was a no-brainer for me. So he took me under his wing, and uh, here I am today, seven years later, and uh, it's wonderful. Well, congratulations Thank to you. you. And can you please tell us about TRM Microwave becoming woman-owned certified? 
Yes, so we just became woman-owned certified last year. In fact, it's something that we contemplated doing for the last five years. Um, our customers really wanted us to become woman-owned because they are required to give 5% of their business away to small women-owned businesses. So we have found it's opened up a tremendous amount of doors of opportunity for us. I've given speeches, like I said, to some senators. I've spoken to the New Hampshire High Tech Council for Women and it's just our customers love the fact that we're women owned and it's opened up opportunities for them and for us to receive more business as well. So it was a great decision. I'm glad we did that. That's wonderful. And Wendy, what kind of challenges have you had to face on a personal and a professional level as a woman in a predominantly male-led industry? Primarily, um, believe it or not, it's being taken serious as a woman. Um, I get a lot of feedback from individuals that meet me uh, but don't spend much time with me that say, oh, she must be just a figurehead or she's just uh, the, the brand, the face of the company. But once they spend five or ten minutes with me, they immediately discover um, how involved I am in the company, how long I've been there, and how passionate I am about it. I attend most meetings. I'm there every day. Um, that, that company, it means the world to me as well as our employees. Uh, well, you're, you're clearly a strong leader. And where do you get your inspiration? Who have been some of your mentors? Um, so Tony um, was my great inspiration uh, to start the business. Um, I have a lot of military family and I've always loved um, the, the industry of protecting our country. And um, I have a very high work ethic and this job is very demanding and you have to stay on top of everything and what's going on and we, have, we face new threats all the time. And so it's just a passion of mine to, to keep this country safe. Wendy, can you please share how both you and the TRM microwave team have been involved in the community? Yes, so I personally am a part of the uh, Big Brother Big Sister program oh, and anytime we have company outings every year, picnics, and we'll do a charity event like I we did Dunk the CEO one year, which I'll never do again, but oh, you're a good sport. <laughs> You know, whatever the employees want to contribute, the sure. company will match it and we'll find local soup kitchens, um, the Big Brother Big Sister program we'll give to, and uh, whatever we can do to help support. And I've also, like I mentioned, done the New Hampshire High Tech Council for Women, uh, where I spoke to about 100 women in different levels of their career and CEOs and women just starting out and shared my entire story with them of how I got to be where I am. And it was a very rewarding experience. It's wonderful. Wendy, can you share some insight into the legacy that you hope to create? Yes. So the legacy I hope to create is to continue um, on the path that we're at, continue growing. Um, we currently have three campuses and we'd like to build a larger building, a larger structure and continue getting the word out and educating our high school and college students about um, this wonderful world of RF microwave engineering. We lovingly refer to it as voodoo because it is such a complicated uh, technology um, that a lot of people are steering away from it. But um, if you're passionate, if you're bright and talented, um, I think most people would be gravitated towards something that's really fulfilling for them. So the legacy I hope to leave is that we continue down this path of keeping our country great and finding new solutions for our customers and their challenges. And Wendy, I know many of your team members have been with the business for many years. What do you think has been key to your success? The fact that we, we keep it a family style business, um, like I said, I've been there 23 years. A lot of my employees have been there. I think the oldest one is 38 years. Um, we do things like uh, quarterly pizza parties. We do, uh, we have a wellness committee that we started. We get, we are actively involved with all of our employees and their lives. We throw parties all throughout the year. I do profit sharing with my employees. They know that I really care and I'm committed to the business. I've actually had an employee come to me and say, I've never had a CEO walk down the hall, not alone just know my name, but acknowledge my existence and presence. So it's great that I can still stay in touch, keep my finger on the pulse, and I still know who everybody is, what their names are. And it's just, it's wonderful. And Wendy, what is most meaningful to you about your work? 
the fact that I can work with companies such as Boeing and Raytheon and Northrop Grumman and BAE, and these are you know the leaders in the industry for keeping you know our national security um, safe, and the fact that. You know, they come to us time and time again. We're on really long-term programs, 20, 30-year programs. We're source on a lot of programs like the Joint Strike Fighter, the F-35. And it's just an honor for me to be the first company that they go to because they know they can trust and rely on us to see them through everything and find a solution to their challenges. And Wendy, as we close, could you please highlight some of the plans that you have for the future of TRM Microwave? Yes, so we're slated to grow 40% this year. Um, we have currently, like I mentioned, three campuses, but we would like to create one large structure uh, to keep everything flowing um, and easy access, because right now we're walking from building to building, um, which can be a little cumbersome. Um, and we're looking to add about 15 more employees this year. We've just hired seven new employees and we've created new positions, and it's just an exciting time for the company. Oh, well, congratulations to you. Wendy, it sounds like you and TRM Microwave are building a legacy of excellence for the next generation of innovators. And thank you thank so you much for joining much, us. Thank you very much, Kathy. It's a pleasure. Thank, thank you. Thank you. For Worldwide Business, I'm Kathy Ireland. Thank you for watching.